Hi guys, welcome to this session in LibreOffice Calc. In this module, I want to show you how you can create a simple calendar that will automatically tell you what day of the week a particular date is. So you can see on the screen there, I've got one month sort of displayed there. If I click on this list here, this is a validated list. If I go whichever month I click, it's telling me what the day is so this is October and it is the 24th and it is a Tuesday so it's actually working and picking things up correctly now if I just put that back to January January the 1st was a Sunday that is how I want it to be that's 2023 so this is only showing you the month because it's formatted to show the month but the actual date is the first of the month and then this cell here is just equaling that that's why it's coming up with zero one so if I change this it's doing March March the first was a Wednesday and so on and so on so this is what I'm going to recreate in this cell down here I'll get myself down the bottom just color that in so it looks or stands out so you know where I'm going so first of all I need to format this to a date and I need to do a validation list there. So data and then validation, valid, validity there. And it's got any value, but I want it to be a list. And I'm going to type the entries that I want to be. So whatever you type here, so I'm gonna go 01 forward slash Jan. I'll just do a couple, zero, 01, well, 03, forward slash Feb, zero, 01, forward slash Mar. So that's my list. Click OK, just check that that works. Yeah. So now on this cell, I'm just going to go equals that. And then, now that's not formatted how I want it. So what I need to do is select... 1st of Jan, it's coming up with the 1st of Jan 23, so that's okay, but I want this formatted so it just comes up with 01, so if I need right click on that and format cells, now that needs to be changed to just day, days, DD, and it should just say 01, and then next one along is just going to be equals that plus one just tick that one and then the format I need to just clone this format so I don't have to keep doing the same thing I'll just double click that down just wipe that across for the whole row and then click that off pull that one across to the end and it should go like so now to do the day so tell me what the 1st of January 2023 was as a as a day I'm just gonna I know I've met I've made a, a line space there but I'm just gonna go directly below it what I want to use is a text function so equals text open bracket on the text so I'll go for um, this cell comma and then what you've got to do is put it in the format you want in quotes. So quotes, I want this to be in three day format. So that'll say sat, mon, sun, that sort of thing. And then close that and then tick. So that's now saying Sunday. So the 1st of January 23 was a Sunday. If I check that one up there, Sunday, that is correct. So now I can pull that over and it tells me what the different things are. Now this needs to be formatted slightly different because I just want this to say as it does up there, the month. So if I right click on this, go into format cells, change this just to be three M's. One, two, three. Okay. So now it just says Jan and then Feb, and then the 1st of Feb would be 
a Wednesday if I just check that up here 1st of Feb is a Wednesday so that's the same so I've only done one week but obviously you just follow this through that one there is just linking up to, to K1 to carry that on so you would just do the same on this down on the next line and carry that on so it's just a very simple calendar obviously you can do a lot more complicated things than that but I just wanted to show you how to do that using the text function and a valid a validity list with some dates in it format to date and how to change the date format so you're not just looking at a full date all the time so hopefully this little video is of use thank you for your time and I'll catch you in the next one